Hi, this is Christy Marie Gott. I'm going to show you how to upload images in WordPress 2012, and I'll show you where the images are saved. If you go over in your dashboard down the left, you'll see where it says Media, and it says Library. This is where the images are saved, and you can also use Add New to upload images to the library. I'm going to show you some other steps over here in a text box, and then we'll come back to the media library in a moment and show you how all this fits together in the total picture. Now this text box could be either a page or a post, and if we're going to upload an image, I would, for instance, click over here where I want to add the image, and I would click Add Media. Now, there are two ways I can get the media. If it's already been uploaded, as you can see, here are all the images that I've uploaded. I could click here and see, we'll click and I'll show you how that works first. Then we'll go ahead and upload something from the computer. When you um, have an image already uploaded, there will be a place over here where you can put a title for the image a caption that will show beneath it if you wish to have a caption, and the alt text, and you want to put that in because for search engine optimization, all the images <laughs> need to have an alt text uh, description. And then down here it says attachment display settings, and you can align it to the left. You can click this arrow, center, right, or none. You can also link the image to a file, and if you want to, you click this down arrow and you can choose a custom URL, attachment page, or a media file. That's if you want to make that image uh, into a hyperlink, like if it's a custom button. And then down here is where you can choose the size. And so you can choose a thumbnail medium size, large, or extra large type size. And so you would make those choices and once you've filled the title and the alt text out, this will uh, stay with that image while it's stored here in the media library. So then I click insert into page and there it is. And I can click on it and I can make it smaller, make it larger, um, I can um, move it to the middle, move it to the left or the right, move it back to the middle by using the alignment um, icons in the menu here. Now we're going to go ahead and delete that image and I'll show you if you're going to add media that hasn't been uploaded to the media library yet, you click over here where it says upload files and this says select files and that will go to your computer. I'm in my computer browsing so I go to the desktop and um, then I just scroll down and look for something that I might want to upload. Um, let's see. Okay here's a little picture of a smartphone and we'll click open. Over here it's uploading. And then over here is where I would type in a title and the alt text. I can type a caption and a description as well. And then I would click here to insert it into the page. So there it is. Now, if you want to go ahead and upload the media before you start to create your page or post, I'll show you how to do that. You just go over here in the left where it says media, it says library and add new and you click on add new and then you can click here where it says select files and once again um, I'm over here in my computer I can go to the desktop and I can upload the image and after it's uploaded then it will be stored here um, these are all of my uh, images. Here we'll. There we go. And back to our page.
page that we were adding. Um, now when you're in the page and you click Add Media, uh, you can also set a featured image. And um, this will be an image that you uh, choose and you click Set Featured Image and then it goes with that poster page when the poster page is shared on social media. And the only other uh, important thing that I want to show you is if you want to, uh, you can add the link back in the previous box the way I showed you or you can click on the image in the text box, click up here where you add a link. The link that shows up will be the one that simply was the JPEG uh, file name in your computer. Then right here you would paste in or type the URL and uh, you can also click open link in a new window tab, put a check mark there and then click update. And that finishes my tutorial on the media library and uploading and adding images to posts and pages. Thanks very much for joining me. Happy computing and have a great day.